Hello! Welcome to today's video. How are we diddly doing? Today is an exciting day. I'm gonna get a Christmas tree. Hear me out here. I live on my own and I was like, is there really much point in me getting a Christmas tree when I just live by myself? And then do you know what? I was like, absolutely. Why? Why not? So today's the 1st of December and obviously that, that is the day to put up your Christmas tree, right? So I thought, why not vlog today and just kind of give you an update because now it's 16 days until my photo shoot, which by the way, I'm absolutely shitting myself for. Oh my God, oh my God. It's properly out of my comfort zone and I don't, oh Jesus. I've got quite a lot of work to do this morning. I'm rewarding myself with buying the Christmas tree only if I get my work done. So, so yeah, I thought I'd just pick up the camera first and tell you what the crack is. But I've just done my cardio, I've been to the gym, I've done my cardio, and now literally I'm gonna have my first meal, which I will show you obviously. Um, it's another high day today by the way, oh my god, literally. So basically, get to give you a bit of a, a, bit of a physique update, I am at the stage where we're happy with how I'm looking, like I don't want to be any leaner, I don't need to be any leaner for a photo shoot, like it's, it's not necessary um, and I want to keep my energy levels quite high because business is absolutely booming, oh my god it's absolutely blowing my mind and it's absolutely amazing and yeah fucking crazy um, and I'm very very grateful and blessed to be where I am but that requires a lot of energy and it got to a point where I was absolutely dying like I genuinely like my check-ins just weren't making sense my clients if you're watching this are absolute fucking angels for bearing with me already had two high days another high day today and we're just going to assess how we're doing because essentially because I'll have more energy I'll probably burn more calories anyway because I'm actually gonna want to do the things, you know, so that's the, that's the thought process. Uh, it's a very exciting day, more food, Christmas tree, business is growing, oh, it's all kicking off. I'm just gonna crack on with some work and stop procrastinating. Okay, so meal one, we've got 250 grams of egg whites, with mushrooms in there I mean oh that failed with mushrooms in there some salad and one bagel thin because it's a high day I get a bagel thin how fucking exciting guys I feel like it's been a while since I last picked up the camera but to be honest I've not really done a lot I've genuinely just been doing check-ins writing programs and do you know what I got a knock on the door and I was like not ordered anything. Well, I did order something and I completely forgot. It's this big old box from, oh my god, I actually can't even do it, from Vista Print. And I'm very excited about this because I'm a bit of a sadder and I'm, I'm a bit of a nerd and I'm a bit of a weird person. If you didn't know that already, you probably watched my videos and you probably gathered this already. I have my own merch and obviously I package everything and I get everything sorted for everyone when they make orders. And me being a little sentimental person, I wanted to add, add a little stamp on the packages if you like. So I ordered some things. I have no idea how to get into this box. I swear to God, every time I do an unboxing on this channel, it doesn't go well. Oh, okay, we're getting somewhere. Oh, I think I've got a paper cut. <laughs> Look at the state of this. <laughs> oh, I'm so shit at opening things. You know, you see these people on YouTube who open things so nice and neatly. Yeah, not me. Just, I'm too impatient for that. I just want to get in and see it. Right. Okay. Oh my god, this is actually so exciting right now. Oh my god. Ah. Right. Okay. So let's go through this order. So on the 19th of December, 
I'm hosting a team get together um, at my gym and we're going to go to Nando's after and I thought because it's Christmas I'm going to give everyone a, a little goodie bag so the first thing we got oh come on these are so cute okay they're a lot smaller than I thought they were going to be <laughs> but I didn't want them big Oh my god, they're actually quite cute. Look at them. Oh, and they've got my logo on there. Look how cute on both sides. Oh, girls, if you're watching this and you're coming to the event, you're going to get a little goodie bag like this. <laughs> I got some stickers with my logo on it. I send my merch off to people who've ordered merch. I will be able to pop a little a little sticker on there because I think they're so cute how cute are they oh see this is what I mean I'm such a saddo I just think about these things because I I personally love that kind of stuff I'm such a little nerd for stationery and any excuse to have a business expense to do stationery I'm there there they are oh. Cute. So yeah, everyone's gonna get like a little message that I'm gonna write on the back with their orders and with their hampers and with everything that they get from me because I appreciate every single one who supports my business and is part of the team. Do you know what? It feels so strange the fact that that per that silhouette that is me. Like you are can't wait for the merch to come now just so I can package everything and make it look extra cute I've got like little parcel bags that are the blue colour told you I'm OCD and oh it's just gonna look so cute so yeah that's my order now I'm gonna go make some food and we're gonna go to Home Bargains and buy my Christmas tree yeah boy once I've finished my whole to-do list we'll decorate the Christmas tree because that's the best thing so basically I went to an event so with my business mentors they hosted like a big event where we did a whole load of networking and loads of speakers came in and I learnt a lot and one of the things that I took home was reward yourself only when you've done the tasks that you've set yourself for the day now when you're self-employed it's very easy to just go oh I'll do that tomorrow or oh never mind I didn't get to do it let's just go and do something exciting so it's like I genuinely won't do anything that I want to do until my to-do list is done so for example the other day I had I went to get my nails done but I physically said to myself I will not get them done until my morning tasks are done so it was just more motivation for me to get my tasks done quicker so yeah if you're out there and you're self-employed or you're working from home set yourself little goals and reward yourself only when you've hit them because i mean i've done it for like two days now and i feel like a new okay so meal two we've got 50 grams of um dry weight jasmine rice vegetables and 100 grams of chicken and i'm gonna put barbecue sauce on everywhere obviously <laughs> but honestly i can't even tell you how great it is to have rice in my life right now like normally i would have this meal with just just the veg and the chicken as you've seen in previous videos if you've seen the previous videos so having rice is literally making my life oh my god coming at you with some really good angles here <laughs> Is that better? Is that gonna stay? Okay. Do you know what? I hate vlogging in my car because I sit very close to the steering wheel so if I moved my chair back and sat like a normal person that seems a lot more appropriate. Oh my god it's absolutely freezing. Now I can't reach my pedal. <laughs> I can't even reach my pedal. Oh my god, well how funny. You think I'll stop? Anywho, the time has come to get a Christmas tree. I wasn't going to, I told you this, but I feel like I need to. So, I'm gonna get a Christmas tree. I'm gonna go to Home Bargains 
because that is the best I think that's the best bet and hopefully I won't spend an absolute fortune but knowing me I'm gonna go and buy festive Zaflora <laughs> festive cleaning products so my house just smells like Christmas because if I'm gonna do Christmas I may as well go all out right I feel like I needed a bit of a, a bit of a pick-me-up I need a bit of festive vibes so let's go to home bargains together folks it's gonna be a good day i hope it's the first of december and i feel like i've maybe left it too late and there's gonna be fuck all there but we're gonna see it's a massive home bargain so fingers crossed there's gonna be a christmas tree because i don't have a christmas tree i don't have any, i don't literally have nothing absolute nothing all i've got that's christmas is a bloody santa mug <laughs> that's it so fingers crossed let's go so uh, only half three but it's dark af anyway went to home bargains and i went to home base home base yeah home base and i acquired some decorations and i acquired a christmas tree which is lovely because oh no because i got to home bargains first and i was like okay there's literally no christmas trees and i've got the last one which to be fair it's like a gray one not like fully gray but it's got like gray it's got like gray specks on it so i'm excited to see what that's gonna look like and do you know what i'm not much of a christmas person i'll be honest so if i'm gonna get a tree it's gonna have to be like a gray gray cool toned just like me i'm like the ice queen my hair is like ice thought you know what may as well get a tree that matches <laughs> i'm joking i'm actually joking but i'm not joking about the christmas part i'm not much of a christmas person um like there's just a lot of tack involved isn't there with christmas and I'm there for the food. I think that's the best part about Christmas for me. That's the food. Everything else, I'm like... I feel like it was somewhat of a successful mission. But it wasn't like a full-on success. Because I only managed to get one pack of baubles. And there's 60 baubles. And it's a six-foot tree. Depending on how much work I get done, I'll treat myself to decorating the Christmas tree. If I don't get enough done, it'll have to be a tomorrow job so we'll see how the day pans out if not i'll just make this a two-day vlog no biggie anywho enough rambling that's the situation that's the crack hey, welcome to my kitchen to make my pre-workout meal on a high day which is my protein oats so i get 50 grams of oats 25 grams of almond butter and 30 grams of whey so i'm gonna make that now I'm going to consume it with great satisfaction and yeah I'll show you when it's done. <laughs> a bit of a side note, if you don't know about these oats from Aldi, get to know that the organic ones are honestly so good and they're so much nice, nicer than any of the oats I've tried. Like so, so many oats I've bought, even like the really really expensive ones, I've got like horrible bits of hard oats in them, like that's not a vibe for me, I'm sorry but... A lot of people rave about these ones. A lot of people rave about... Loads and loads of people on the internet rave about these ones. I'm sorry, they're just not even... They're not even worth the hype. I'm sorry if that hurts someone's feelings, but... Save yourself some money and jump on these, because they're actually sensational. They make my oats so creamy. Like, I only make it with water, and it's so great. So... Put this bit of information with Esto 101. <laughs> oh my God, here it is. How beautiful is that? So we've got 50 grams of oats, 30 grams of whey. I used this one, the carrot cake. Honestly, carrot cake paired with this almond butter, the toffee apple one. Get this in Tesco, absolutely sensational. What a combo I've, I've run out. It's that good, look at that. Absolutely unreal. Good evening i know it literally looks like it's the same the same time but it, i can assure you it is not it's the evening and we've had a change of plan as per usual nothing ever goes to plan in my life these days but we are 
Oh, I should not have started that, should I? Bear with me whilst the kettle boils, I'll be back. <laughs> anyway, after being really rudely interrupted by my kettle, what I was saying was, today has not gone to plan. I'm behind on work and basically I am planning ahead my week and basically on Friday I'm meeting my business mentor and we're doing a, a leg session and my recovery time is really slow at the moment so if and today was supposed to be a leg day so if I was to train legs today which is a Wednesday I'd be still sore and crippled on Friday which I don't want really so I'm taking today as a rest day so, which is actually really handy because that means I can get all my work done. I can actually decorate my Christmas tree. So I'm going to go to Tesco um, after I've done a few tasks that I've got to do. And then I'm going to go to Tesco. I'm going to hopefully get some more baubles because I've only got one box at the moment. And then we're going to decorate my Christmas tree tonight. I'm so excited. Also, I need to share this discovery with you all because it's actually phenomenal. So obviously it's cold now, isn't it? It's absolutely grim. And there's nothing more warming to the soul than having a nice drink, you know, a nice warm drink. And at the moment I'm really obsessed with herbal teas because obviously there's like no calories in them if you don't put any milk or any sugar or whatever in them, which I don't, obviously. This is absolutely sensational. It's the Pucca Wild Apple and Cinnamon Organic tea i don't know how they do it but it's like sweet it genuinely is like sweet apples and like a hint of cinnamon and if that doesn't scream christmas and winter and just warm soul vibes then i don't know what does do you know what i mean like it's actually sensational and i'm gonna have this finish off my work for the day and then we're going to go to Tesco and hopefully get some baubles. If not, we'll go Asda because they're next to each other. So I'm hoping one or the other will have fucking baubles because if not, it's going to be a very naked tree at this rate. So fingers crossed, but we'll be there together. Whatever happens, we've got each other's backs. Okay, so we have progress. So I've got these cute little silver and blue baubles from Tesco along with all of these I've gone with a blue and silver theme I think that will work quite nicely with the tree then we've got this from home base They're pretty cute there's quite a lot in there and then we got the tree I will show you what the tree looks like. I have no idea. It was the only one that was left. It looks quite cute. I ain't got a fucking clue, but it'll do. Um, and then I got these, which I'm very excited about because I think it will match the lights really well. But look how cute. How cute is that? I also got a throw as well because I needed one for my sofa because it's cold as fuck. So, so yeah, and then obviously I got lights. I went with warm. Now I'm not sure if it's going to work. I kind of regret it. I kind of wish I went with cool. But they're warm lights but those. So I'm thinking that was a good idea. But we'll see. This might be an absolute fail. But I'm trying to be festive here. I really am. <laughs> no! So we're in my living room. Oh, the lighting isn't great, is it? Ugh. Is that better? Not really. But anyway, we're on. I've got my Pepsi Max here, got some YouTube on, and we're going to do the Christmas tree. And do you know what? Oh, let me show you. It's grey, and it's got sparkly bits on it. That's not me in a Christmas tree, I don't know what it is. Oh my god, I'm actually excited. But, oh god, do you know what? I'm going to get glitter everywhere. Oh no, oh, fucking hell. I'm going to get glitter everywhere and I have black carpets so this is going to be really fun for me. I regret. I regret. Oh, already glitter is everywhere. Okay. Oh god this tree's, this tree's fucking huge and there's glitter. Yeah I'm glad I didn't hear my floor just yet because there's glitter everywhere. There's actual glitter everywhere. <laughs> Oh, 
I'm trying so hard to be festive. Right, let's get the stand up. Can you see that? Oh my god, I'm covered. Oh well. It's only Christmas once, eh? Only Christmas once. Oh, I'm gonna do this. So I'll just spread it. Like that, right? base of the tree. Oh my god. There's supposed to be a screw. Ah, there is a screw. <laughs> I would have so thrown this away. <laughs> okay, what do I do with this? I think this is the bottom. How are you supposed to know? Have they got numbers on them? No. How does this take an hour and a half? There's only three bits to it. Why am I being retarded? What? Normally you have to like put the little individual twigs on them. Oh my god, this is actually so messy, I don't like it. <sighs> Come on, I stay be festive for once in your life and Can you imagine if I left it like this? <laughs> Look at it! Oh, perfect! I've nailed it. Some Christmas songs on and try me. <laughs> Got progress. I've done the tree. She looks quite cute actually. I'm actually quite happy with her. But how on earth am I gonna do these lights? Like I don't actually know what how I'm gonna do it. Hey! Ah. Okay, 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 I'm so nervous about this. goodness <laughs> I literally do you know what if there's ever gonna be a video where I actually managed to end it on the day I filmed the video that is gonna be the best day ever because I don't think I've actually managed to do it once yet in my entire filming career <laughs> Oh, goodness me. Well, I feel like this vlog has been very all over the place, so I do apologise, but I have decorated my Christmas tree that looks cute, so... <laughs> Little Miss Scrooge is trying her best to be festive, but you may or may not know, Christmas for me isn't the best time of year. I'm just not a fan of it. I don't know why. I just think it's a bit overrated. People are gonna hate me for saying that, but that's just my personal opinion. And 
But anyway, I'm trying, okay? And that's all you can do these days is just try. So, I am going to leave end the video here. If you liked the video and you like my Christmas tree, please let me know because I thought it was gonna look like a pile of shit to be honest because I've never I've never really decorated a Christmas tree by myself that is huge I've never done that before but yeah let me know if my Christmas tree meets the standards if you like the video please give it a thumbs up if you would like to see future videos please don't forget to subscribe and I will see you in the next video bye